How to set sale prices for Shopify products with variance. Hey guys, welcome back. In this quick tutorial, let me show you how to set up sale prices for Shopify products with variance. So let's get into it. First of all, you're going to open up your Shopify store and you will get right here. You can see this is my Shopify.com admin. So once you get to the admin, what you need to do is you're going to go to your products. In your products, you will select the product where you want to change the sale prices for each variant. So you're going to select the product. So this is the product that I have. I'm going to scroll down to options. So here we have options. You can see options or variants too. Uh, so you can see variants. Click on add. And here I'm going to select sizes. In sizes, let's actually create the variants first. Uh, so in sizes, I'm going to go with small. And then we're going to go for medium. And then we're going to go for a large. So once it's done, click on done right here and the variants will be created. So once the variants are created, now we can set up the sale price. You can see I can now upload separate pictures for each variant. Then we have the prices. So here we can customize the price. Let's say the small one is maybe 2000 and then the other one is actually 2500 and then we have this one so maybe this one is 3000 so this is how we can customize the prices for each variant right here uh, we can also customize other options such as sku availability and barcode so this is how we add prices for each variance and now you can select the variance to maybe perform bulk actions or add a uh, more variance so click on add another option it will create more variants for you and you will customize the pricing right here it can have a separate uh you know price from the main product right here and each variant can have its own properties click on save and the prices will be set for each variant of your product on shopify i hope that i was a big help don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up leave a comment down below turn on bell notification and subscribe to youtube channel